They're loud, annoying, backup traffic, and worst of all, extremely dangerous. They think they're professional drivers, and they're not. There's been times where they've lost control of their vehicles, and the vehicles spun out of control into the crowd, and people get hurt. In Oakland this past weekend, violence and destruction when armed spectators looted a truck and set a transit bus on fire while hurling bottles and rocks at law enforcement officers. You had thousands of people participating in an illegal sideshow where vehicles were set on fire, shots were fired, people were injured, and that's what we don't want to happen here. So investigators have turned to social media to help them. Everybody's out there with their cell phones trying to videotape the sideshow. Well, you can get in trouble for that because you're actively participating and encouraging a legal type of activity. And it's those videos that participants post that help investigators catch those responsible. If we can identify where that vehicle's at, we'll get a warrant from a judge and we'll go seize that vehicle. Many times participants that get away think they're in the clear, but it just takes one of these videos displaying a license plate or another unique marking on the vehicle that gets them caught. Many times, parents don't realize their vehicles are used by their kids in these sideshows until it's too late and their vehicle is being impounded. These illegal sideshows are extremely dangerous. They turn violent, and we've seen innocent people hurt at these sideshows, and that's what we don't want to happen here in our community. In Stockton, Walter McCullough, KCRA 3 News.